Hello friends, today we make push button control bulb using Arduino. Now we start the project. First we open Tinkercad. This is a Tinkercad that code. Now search the component Arduino. Then drag and drop here. Again we search push button. This is a push button. And take one breadboard. You can use mini breadboard and put the button on the breadboard. Now take one resistor. Change the value of resistor into 10k. And now search bulb. You can take this bulb. And now connect the circuit. Push button control connect to the terminal of 2A for the push button. I have connected the resistor to the 2A for the terminal of push button. Second terminal of resistor connect to the ground pin of the Arduino. Ground pin. Same pin you have to connect. Terminal number second A you have to connect any digital pin of the Arduino. I have connect three pin, three digital pin. And change the color. Now connect the bulb. There is two terminal on the bulb. Any terminal you have to connect for the ground of the Arduino. Also change the color black. And second terminal you have to connect any digital pin. I have connect to the 8 pin of the Arduino. In the push button we have to connect the power pin. Terminal number 1B connect to the power of the Arduino. Power pin of the Arduino. Power means 5 volt. I have connected 5 volt to the Arduino. Now circuit is completed. Now we make the code. Click on the code section and delete this block. You have to select block and click on the variable and create block. I am using button, so I am writing button. Then click OK. You can see there is generated three block. Take this set block, and in the set block, you have to put the block for the button. Button is connected to the third pin of the Arduino. Use digital write block, and the button value is three and go to the output block and use the serial monitor block. In the hello world we have to put variable block because I want to see the value of push button. Now start and click on the serial monitor and you can see the value. There is value 0 when I am pressing the button then you can see value is 1. Now I am giving the condition. Go to the control block and use if else block. Now go to the math section for the, you have to put the condition. In the first block you have to put the variable block and here you can put equal to when the button value is 1 then bulb will be on. Go to the output block, take set pin and another take set pin. Button is connect to the digital pin of the Arduino. Digital pin 8. Now select the 8 pin. Another second 8 pin. If condition is followed, then bulb will be high. If condition is not followed, then bulb will be low. Now start simulate. And you can see the output. If I am pressing the button, also open the serial monitor. If I am pressing the button, the value is 1. Then bulb will be on. Because the condition is following, if the button value is 1, then bulb high. If the condition is not follow, the 8 pin is low. You can see here is the value is 0, then one bulb will off. When I am pressing, then condition is 1, then bulb is on. You want to take the text code, stop the simulation and go to the block plus text. You can see this is a text code. You want to make a hardware project, you can make that. Again, I am going to the block and start simulate and see the output. When I am pressing the button, then bulb will on. If you have any problem, you can also comment also. 
Thank you all friends.